try sign condolence register and tears begin roll out and she they cry they lament the death of the prophet Over there, over there, yes. Let's go. Synagogue member since 1993. So I'm also a worker, a Christ worker. With no different department that I no work for here. It's only security that I no work now. I work for bakery, I work for water, the blood of Jesus. 
I work for Kati, I work for talk, Lord Rick. Talk to us about the man of God. Yes, he's the one that I hold all this thing. It's not for my bountiful father. He's a bad prophet, he be just I'm saying about. He's the one that hold us, training us for, for the future of us. So he leaves uh, bless, a lot of blessing for us. About the, about the, to say about the man of God, he's, very, he's, a, he's, he's a very careful father, lovely father, merciful father. He's, he, he, he's, he's, he's the, 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 he's the father of the fatherless. He, the, he's the hope of the homeless. He's the heart of the heartless. It 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 it, it provides everything for us. It train us in the way of the Lord. I could I to live with lion and tiger. No human being there is lion and tiger. He teach us how to live with them. I, I overcome them. We are free from right, them. Sir. Without you. they harm you. you. Okay. So he's 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 a really man of God. He's the ultimate commander. The, the chief ultimate commander. The director. All right, thank you. Yeah. Let, let's talk to another person yeah, also. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Behind you, there's another person. Okay, thank you. Mama. Me, please make it brief, just for one minute. Okay, okay. Yes. God be the glory. Hold on, sir. Hold on, sir. Uh, they, they can speak. They can speak. As soon as they will describe him well. Oh, okay, okay. Hold on. No, thank you, sir. So, no, so, put cameras on me. Almost, you understand? London calling. London. Uh, we said almost, almost. Okay. Okay, sir, talk to us. Uh, tell uh, us about the prophet. My name is Akundi Adekondi from the States. To God be the glory. God has given us wonderful prophet for our nation, Nigeria, Africa, and the world. As well. And God has been using him in our life, spiritually guided us in many ways, which we may not appreciate, and the Bible is there to tell us the reason why. If not, this place is supposed to be occupied by Nigerians. It's always like that. So we are here to appreciate God for his life, uh, what God has used him to do in our life, life of our family and many others which we know he may go he, he said physical something may go body may go the spirit of god that grace of god in life in his life we know is still remain and even is still with us here even though we cannot see spiritually our being that is spirit still with us which we believe we still continue to live with god in jesus name come this way all right mama let's talk to you english 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 just hold on Continue, continue. Okay. It's okay. So, my talk to us. Um, can I introduce myself? Yes, please. I am Mrs. Margaret Daniels. I am one of the workers here who worked here for a long time. I was a shattered woman. A nobody before I knew Prophet TB Joshua. My knowing him made me somebody, somebody will say, Oh, good morning to today. Because then I was a laughing stock in my community, in my environment. People laugh at me, they jeer at me. But when I met Prophet TB Joshua, today I am somebody who can say, Sister, take a loaf of bread and eat. I am somebody who can say, Sister, take a cup of rice and eat. Because of what? The grace of Prophet T.B. Joshua in my life. What he, he, he picked me up from the gutter and he made me somebody who is living in a tower today. Because of him, I, I, I can stand on my feet. Then I was a wobbling woman. But because of him, that is why I say, I know he is only gone in the flesh and not in the spirit. He is still with us. All right, thank you so much, man. Thank you very much. What, do, what would you want to say about the prophet? You tell us your name and tell us uh, what you want my to say. My name is Vivian Damian. In fact, my father, Prophet TB Joshua. Say been, your name again. My Vivian Damian. Okay. He be, he be a good father to us. He's a very caring father, lovely father, 
father that understand when your children was feeling feeling pain. In fact, God, my father, Brother TB Joshua, take care of me before I am nothing. In fact, I'm a, I'm a useless person. But Jesus, uh, Brother TB Joshua, make me what I am today. And he's the one that laid the foundation I'm enjoying today. I don't think I can forget that sort of father in my life. And I'm praying to God that God should bring a father like Prophet T.B. Joshua to us. Because he's very caring father, loving father. He's more than caring. He cared for me more than my mother, more than my father, more than my sister, more than my husband. I pray to God wherever he is. God, God, God will continue to bless him and give him everlasting rest. In the mighty name of Jesus. Mama, you, you don't stand for some time. I hear whatever you want to. Oh yeah. If I make it up, uh, I'll come to you. Who will hear you talk? Who come in? Can you come? Speak fast. Yes, I come to So, the more she better. I Oh, he let me know. Oh, he the family me. Ben or Lofu Alovo, as a widow. Oh, there is Chefua, Okoa John, as a widow be by. Oh, there Fu and Bobunko. There Santisha Timodua, Kofi Mille, Kofi Boko Wale. I'm a worker for the church. So, Baba She, Oshe, Kofu Boba Baye, a mule bag bear. Colo ba mi te sa fe fe le. Colo ba mi te sa fe fe le. Then daddy prophet Joshua. Colo ko jo ko je ko duro ko de she yanu bi baba wa she she to be lo. Thank you. In English. English. Oh, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Man, man, you don't forget yes, yes. Uh, this is the last one. My name is. Uh, I'll just hold on a little. Okay. okay. Um. My name is Ogachukumachu. I'm a worker in this synagogue church of Formation. When I came here, I was just like a walking coffee. I don't know what I'm doing. Pastor T.B. Joshua took me from many departments to departments. He delivered me from many contrary powers. If not the grace of God in the life of the Mutokwe Balogu Joshua, I don't know where I would have been. As he was coaching me, I went to teacher's training, I did my NCB, I did my BS. He took me high, from high to high. He told me that God has a big plan for me, but he don't know what I'm planning for myself. If not God of the Mitobe Balog with Joshua, I will have been mental on the way. He delivered me from mental disorder from what is happening from my generation when I was not yet born, but he delivered me. That spirit was in me, says no way to happen to me. Deliver me and set me free. Today I can be able to give people food. I can be able to stand. I can be able to count. But when I came here, I was nothing. I don't even know myself. It made me what I am today. His grace, I know that he's not gone forever, but he's he going to change us, he's still praying for us. And the teaching I received from him, I know that he's going to lead me to the end of my life. All right, thank you. Let's get some men. Some men. Okay. Uh, Mark will talk to some. Okay. Yes. Okay. God bless you. Thank you. So I bet we won't talk to people we won't talk to us about the prophet. How you feel describe him, how you won't talk to us about her. What do you know about her? You will we'll start with you, Bob. English first. English first. Oh, we'll do English first or pigeon. Which one day? Pigeon or, or English first. Madam, we don't do finish with women and men now. Eh? 
Oh, pigeon now. Talk to me for pigeon. <laughs> uh -huh. Even if you don't speak English, speak pigeon for me. Tell me your name and what you know about the prophet. Um, Okay, tell us your name and um, what thing you know about the prophet. Okay, my name is Peter Andobwe. Um, I'm a member of this church. My group is Salvation First. The prophet is a good man. The kind man we have in Nigeria that nobody knows. Many people don't know him. But I myself, the little time I spent with him, he has taught me a lot. He has led down many teachings. That like anybody that follows him, we must make we must make careful. He's the only true prophet. I call him the major prophet of our time. Because he's like Isaiah, he's like uh, Jeremiah, he's like uh, Elijah, he's like Elisha. I never see a true prophet like that before. He's a God sent. I love him so much. All right, thank, thank you. you. Check this place over there. Okay. I'm going to take some shots. Let's take more, more shots from the people that are registering their condolences for the condolence register. to get to this one. Okay, thank you. Yes. I have permission, I have permission. Okay, go on, go on. Yes, I have permission. 
Sorry. Sometimes in my in a couple, there was no light. People who paid all their bills, all their printed bills, for them to have that. So, the uh, man of God has got a lot of impact on the others in a couple both financially, morally. No aspect of life, the aspect yes. and the part of life. So the funness, the God given shot about the day, the program that is presently presently organized. The project. I think presently Stanford was preaching a certain event in Akoko, in Arigi. That that involve about the 60 acres of land. And more than 200 people are working there as a But I know by the end of that event, I know it's trying to. Who know? I know it will bring something tangible to our people as a whole. What Snapchat have done, the government in our state cannot do it. No anybody, nobody in our country has done it as a whole. Who has ever done it? We felt the impact. You know what felt the impact? I pray to God that God should forgive him. God should forgive him, the Lord's forgiveness. The whole universe will plead on behalf of God and Joshua for God to forgive him. He has done a great, he's a great Messiah. He's so rest in perfect peace. Yeah. Uh -huh. 
My name is. No, you don't have to bend to the. Okay. okay. Just stay where you are. Okay. Just like this. Yeah. It's okay. I'm getting. I'm picking it already. Yes. Hold My on, name sir. is Sengina Biodo. Hold on, sir. Hold on, sir. Okay. Yes. Sir. My name is Sengina Biodo. Of course. I came from. Thank you very much. Actually, I don't worship the squad. I was with Redin. But it's a man that I fell in love with right from my day one. You understand? So when I heard about the death of this, I was on net. Saturday night, stroke, Sunday night, uh, Monday, Sunday morning when I read about the passing away about this man of God. I felt very shocked. When Abu Four, I said, well, it is time. It's God that called him. He has fulfilled his promise on the head. Abu Four, we so rest in peace. NST uh, Synagogue Church of All Nations, the Church of uh, the Prophet TB Joshua, we die on Saturday. We don't do here since morning. Um, but we never tell where they give us permission to shoot, and that's why we're giving you this live broadcast day two since we're announcing that. And um, as you can see, lots of people still gather here, the morning dead. Many of them are crying. Many of them they signed the condolence register where they open today. Uh, many of them they by the corner, just watching what's going on. Many of them still they confused up till now. Many people who we don't talk to, like you they watch this live that is press. So many things about the late prophet and. Uh, them still they wait around for the next action point they go release for now the church nor the family is yet to release any plans for burial the church and the family never even talk also about anything concerning who go take over from the late prophet rather people still did the the try to sign the condolence register. They'll bring him in. Okay. Perfect. Perfect. This is not the first time we I go see men, they shed tears, they cry in reality over the death of somebody. And they see so many able bodied men with their hair. Even though they hide their face, they cry. But yeah. But well, here See this man where they come now. He's been crying. Not really this one, the one behind him. Sup? Sorry, here, yeah, please. Come. 
Okay, sir. Okay, sir. Perfect. That is okay. So, sir, it's going to be a brief one just to tell. It's okay, don't move. Don't move, it's okay. Just tell us briefly your name and why you are here and why you're expressing so much emotions today. My name is Marcus Joe. I'm a police officer. Mm. I live here at Asad in Calabar. I just hear a private place uh, and not believe. But this is the time we need to provide you. This is the time we need this man. And it's the main time we need this man. So the world is in trouble. At least the government left us without information, without anything. Who will take us away from all this problem? That's my cry. It's not this man today that will pass away. Nobody can do where he was. I have a very problem in my heart, a problem in my heart. The doctor said it's over. He said it's going right by way. Then somebody took me down here. Two thousand and eight. I was still here. I went to the doctor who said that you can't write my He said, I do not believe. He said, and it's over. I heard private teachers are private. He said, I do not believe. He said, you can't believe. So when I, I worked with in that company as a strategy officer, when I went back the second week, the man said, it is true that my problem is over. I say you can believe in God. And I give a testimony here. One side of my heart blood. Blood cannot pass in. And if go like this, I come back like this. But probably just I touch. What about the young generation? Oh, we are old. We are going. I What about the young girls who are coming? Who said that? Who left them? Now the world is in trouble. Who left them out? Who help us out? So that's my cry. Now. I said now. So the team, when I remember him, see that, see yesterday I had this thing, I cannot sleep. So I'm walking the road down, my eyes turning, and I try to manage. But this thing is true, I believe. Then I see for BBC and CNN, and I, come, I said, okay, maybe he's sleeping, maybe he can, any time for night, he can call us that, it's in his over. He said, it's all is. He has passed away. How can we do? This is the time we need property with Joshua. And this is the time he left us. I started all my way of crying. So thank God for his soul. The soul in his peace. God take him. God give it to us and he take it away from us. We cannot argue anything come from God. We cannot argue for it. We thank God. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Believe God. All right, sir. Thank you so much, sir. Um. Yeah. For me. Okay. I want to conclude our live um, broadcast from the particular location this morning at yeah, this uh, afternoon um, people still gather still they talk so much about the late prophet tb joshua you can see in a dead in the sign the condolence register some people already signed some people still they come around some people are just hanging around trying to
tried to come and sign the register and uh, okay. your name sir Okay, my name is uh, Hold on, Brother sir. Glory. Hold on, sir. Sir, don't, Brother don't Glory. move forward. Hold on, sir. Hold on, sir. Hold on, sir. Just move. My phone is getting, the camera is getting you. So, let's have this, sir. Go okay. ahead. My, my name is uh, Brother Glory Igodaro. Uh, I hear from Delta State. I am actually a member of Snaggle Church of Foundation. Um, when we heard the news, it was shocking, unbelievable. But uh, the Bible says, in whatever situation we find ourselves, we shall give thanks to God. Because God who gave it, as I actually take it. But there's one thing I believe in my heart. Um, though we miss it physically in our present, but it's going to be more effective now, now that it has gone to rest the person of the Lord. So what else can I say? There is not enough words to express his generous, his kindness, his humanity service to West mankind and God has said to come at you. But he has done more than nothing. I pray may his gentle soul rest in the bosom of the Lord Jesus. Alright, cut off our call then. So let me call Joseph. Bro, how far? Cut off, where does it Ah, okay. <laughs> so, um, before we round up the live broadcast this morning from the Synagogue Church of All Nations, we did for Lagos. I go like giving a brief of things so we don't find out throughout today. Um, so far, they never announced the barrier date and they never talk anything about the succession plan or who will take over from the, the late prophet T.B. Joshua. As you can see from the major road into the road beside the church people still gather in their numbers people still gather uh, along the road many of them sit sitting down some stand some day by the corner some day cries the gist is still all about the prophet tb joshua the flags around the church still they fly at half mast since yesterday when they announced the death of the prophet um this building which is the main church auditorium according to people where they worship here say it don't they see it for about a year since we could be start so even now where they don't announce him that the building is still not open the doors are still sealed